Okay. The template, by the way, is on our website at MarthaStewart.com, and, uh, and, and the d directions are also there. Yes. So that, yes. you start, these are we, the secret. Right. The squeeze bottles, yeah. which, uh, I mean, it feels to me like drawing, so right. which is why I went to these um, instead of the piping bag. Piping bag, yeah. Um, and we're going to start with red in this um, fatter bottle with the wide tip, and we're okay. going to just ice the base. So okay. um, it's a red base. Yes. And we outline. So does this get redder as it dries? It does. The red always develops a little bit, so we have it a little bit lighter just because... Like a week later, it'll look darker. Okay. So, so you make a little dam, and then you fill the dam. Right? Exactly right. I just do like a zigzag, um, but you could just keep outlining, however. And then. Did um, you finish already? I did. Come on. Oh, oh, you did. Oh, but you didn't smooth it. Huh? I didn't smooth yet. Oh, I no. thought it was all smooth so, already. Um, <laughs> so, so give it a little shake so the icing evens out. Right. And, then and it will settle too. It right? will also. And then you could also pop any air bubbles you see with the tip of your toothpick. Okay. Which is always good, and then we're going to use. Um, and you can put too much icing, but doing it with no. doing it with that little um, squeeze bottle uh, or with a piping bag actually makes a much prettier cookie. And then yes. just sprinkle. Yep. This is red sanding this sugar. This is not glitter. This is sugar. <laughs> Don't make the mistake of using glitter. <laughs> it is not edible. That would be bad. Yes, it would. Okay, be. Okay, so and then we're just going to shake it off. And you want to let this dry, I say a minimum of 10 minutes, oh, if you could leave so it a little pretty. bit longer and okay. do the rest. So we have some dry. Exactly, we have the dry base. Okay. And, and now, now we're going to draw the Ooh. sky. Okay. So um, I always outline the globe first. Oh, all the way, not all the way around. Not all the way, just start kind of like a, a little bit up. Give yourself like about half an inch. Okay, and then you're drawing the negative space of the mountain, so it's always good to refer to the template. Hmm. Oh, it's so kind you're, of like three little hills. And same thing, I'm gonna do the zigzag to fill in. Okay. And this icing is really good consistency. Oh, it's, it's perfect. Now, what is your icing? It's royal icing made with meringue powder. Oh, so you're not using real eggs? No, no real eggs. And um, if it's too thick, I add water by the tablespoon. Do you put any lemon juice in it or any flavoring? Um, I ha you know, I haven't in a while, but that, that actually is a really good tip. You can flavor it with lemon, mm -hmm. which is tasty. So for, since this is a bigger section, I'm using the offset spatula to smooth and it I'm, out. And I'm doing and the wrong thing. And you're using the toothpick. You I'm could using do either. the toothpick. We're, we're flexible here. We're going to shake this I out also so it evens out. I picked up the wrong out. tool because I'm, and you're all done already. I'm going to pop some air bubbles. Okay. With the, with the toothpick? With the toothpick tip. Okay. Okay. Oh, this is so beautiful. Yes. Okay. Okay, so now again. Okay. Are and now sprinkle, I'm going to add we, my little decorations. So oh, there's no sprinkles on this. There's not yet. We're going to add the decorations first. So I have these two ginger men. Okay. And these these guys are so cute. They're at the top of the hill holding hands. Oh, cute. Where'd you get them? They're from. They're from. I found them at Cake and Bake. So oh, they're all pre-made. And pre-made. Are they edible? And, uh, they're edible candy, kind of like cake decorations. And I just oh. thought they were so cute. So. Oh. This is... And then we're adding the edible snowflake decorations. Okay. Four on this side, three or four on the other side. Okay, and then, oops. Last little sugar decoration is a heart that goes in the middle of them. Because they're friends. Okay, and then we're gonna finish it with coarse sanding sugar. These are beautiful. Thank you. Oh, and you're putting the sugar all over it? Exactly, all over the top. Okay. And then you shake Does it Does mine off. look okay? It looks great. Oh, perfect. One more. Of course. You're faster than I am, but you've been practicing. <laughs> I've been okay, doing them so. uh, for weeks. Okay, just leave this to dry for 10 minutes. Uh-huh. Okay. 10 minutes again, just because you don't want to put your, put your hand okay. in it by mistake. Oh, I'm sorry, I grabbed yours. Now, we're going to do the mountain. Okay. So, so it's solid white yeah, mountain? Just solid white. We're going to fill it in. We're using the fine tip here just so we could get a really nice outline. And no no space. You don't want to see any no, cookie. Right, exactly. You go right to the red base, and then we fill in. Yeah, this Let's one's sticking a little yeah, bit. Yeah, I think a little bit. And then we use the spatula again. Exactly, except for... Except we don't have one. We could use a toothpick. It's really whatever you become comfortable with. Okay. So, we're going to smooth that out. Oops. 
And then the finishing touch on the mountain is the non white nonpareils. Oh, so so they're dull. So they're, they're covered, not... yeah, and they look little like little little mini, mini, mini snowballs. Okay. And then the fun payoff is when you scoot this off, it looks like you're turning the snow globe. Now you're making these special order for people too? I have a few orders, yes, for Christmas. In your free time? In my free time, when I never oh, sleep. That's right. There's no time for sleeping, not when you're making these exactly. amazing cookies. <laughs> exactly. Oh, look. Perfect. Oh, oh my gosh. Utterly gorgeous. <laughs>